let's go ahead and go back to our focus camera. So again, this is going to be the one we were using from before, which means that our east type is slow left and right, but immediate up and down. And then the type we were currently using was by screen size. But if we were to say we wanted to use it by tile size, then we could use the tile padding up and down on this. So we could say maybe we want to be more specific. We want it to be a, uh, a tile above the uh, player. And then we want maybe left to be immediate, but then right to have a little bit of uh, extra padding out here. We'll say we take it to here. So this works well, but just remember that on different screen sizes, um, you may have a, you may think it works well, but then all of a sudden this doesn't actually work until you, you're off screen. So it's something just to be a little, uh, a little careful with when you start using the tile size for the camera. All right, so we'll go ahead and use that one right here. And so now at this point, when I move here, it's always going to be almost a constant when I'm moving this way. But when I move this way, it's not going to update until I get almost to there. So now I have a further point forward, um, and then I have my box starting back to there. And then on the up and down, we were one tile above, so then he starts to move when he gets up to there. All right, so it's just blocking out the space for where the player can start pushing the camera, and then the camera following the player once he starts to move. 